Welcome to ClockClass.com. I'm David Labounty. Today we are discussing arbor and barrel hooks. This is one that we're going to replace today. Just to give you an idea of what we're going to do, we're going to start by making a screw that has a specific shoulder height here that will accept the mainspring. We'll drill a hole through the arbor if there's not already one there, unfortunately ours already has one. But sometimes in this in the chiseled out style, the style that has a chiseled out arbor hook, if the arbor hook gets broken off, you can use that area, that indentation where the chisel mark is, kind of as a start. But we'll drill a hole through the arbor, we'll thread that hole, tap it to accept our screw. Our screw has a little oversized head on it. We will peen over the end to lock that in place, and then we'll just start shaping the head of the screw. And it goes rather quickly. So this is essentially the process that we're going to be doing today. Okay, And as I said, it helps to pay attention to the shape of the original. You want to match that as closely as possible. Now at this point, it doesn't really matter which side our arbor hook is on. We are going to have to remember, however, at some point when we're shaping the head, which direction this screws, which direction this turns to wind up the mainspring. Okay, looking rather nice there. Notice also while I was there, I machined off that peen. I just ground that off. Okay, we don't want that sticking up and catching things. Okay, 